I've watched her at Speaker's Corner. This is a lady who, on her own, has shown more courage than any man I know. Yeah? She has, and I'm seriously concerned for her as I'm watching this. Um, she's on the, she's very close to becoming a ma, um, which I would hate to see. In fact, Jesus, and I worry about my safety here. Yeah. I'm watching this lady throwing herself right in the fire. Now, so this Sunday, I watched, she was physically attacked three times in the last month. The police have took her free speech from the bastion of free speech and speaker's corner in, in Hyde Park. They've removed her from the park because of hostility from aggressive young Muslims who want to attack her violently, hosti throw her on the floor. This Sunday, I'm going to go um, because I want to show my love to her. I'm going to bring her flowers. I'm going to bring her chocolates. Um, I want to show her how much I appreciate what she's been doing. And Okay, I just wanted to share this video. Yeah. Um, apparently, Tommy Robinson is going to go Sunday. This Sunday, actually, 11 o'clock. Um, yeah, this this is the thing. Um, you know, something's not right for me because the thing is, like, Tommy Robinson, I don't know why he would get involved by this, um, you know, this Hatun thing because, let me tell you the truth, Hatun is one of the biggest, biggest hater uh of islam she she's been doing it from day one um i've seen her doing it other muslim seen her doing it um the thing is we know what hatun is like we know muslims we know that hatun goes to the park um to spread hate to spread to spread hate speech in the park seriously like as a christian I'm sure some Christian com de uh, confronted her, even the uh, even the black lady, the Christian lady who was in the park, confronted her when she was speaking to Ali Dawa, confronted her in front of her face that this is not this the the Christian way, this is not Jesus, this is not this is not the Jesus way. She is she is a hater. She is a hater. She hates Muslims. She hates Islam. She doesn't respect any Muslim females or males. It doesn't. She doesn't care. What she does is she hates speech. She spread hate. She doesn't have a civilized conversation. So why do I need to waste my energy with this lady? She doesn't have a civilized conversation. And when I mean civilized conversation, I mean that she doesn't really understand a lot of things. She doesn't understand anything. She just shout, 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 shout. Yeah. And uh, Tommy is go going Sunday with his group TR movement. The reason why Tommy is going because of Hatun, because she got slapped by her face. I don't agree with the brother who slapped her. Yeah, I I feel disgusted by it. I condemn it. I don't like when someone slaps a lady. That is disgusting. Even though Hatun showed cartoon pictures or holes in the Quran, as Muslims, we should walk away. The best thing is walk away because we know the prophet doesn't really look like that. That doesn't that we don't know what the prophet uh, looks like. Only Allah knows best. That's not the prophet. She can make cartoons all she likes, or she can do whatever she wants. But let me tell you this, Muslims. We have to be careful, yeah, because this lady, she wants to provoke Muslims. And when I mean provoke Muslim, I mean the youngsters, the young Muslims. They have blood boiling in their veins. They would, con they would have outrage that they would hit her. Now let me tell you this, Tommy Robinson. I don't know why he's going, but it seems to me that Tommy's going because of how Dawn sending her flowers first, send her chocolate. It just means like this is like. To me, this is like, I don't know what is going on with this. So, like, yeah. On the, on the, on the argument of free speech, uh, she is right now single-handedly, I'd say, in the world, 
the forefront activists on this point. Many of us have been in positions of battles for free speech, whether it's my previous court case, and, and Speaker's Corner, she, she's been doing this in Wandley. Can you explain what, what she's actually saying? Is, is upsetting the, 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 the... So she, she goes every week, she holds the Quran, she does, she does the thing where she says there's 26 different versions of the Quran, maybe 30 now, isn't it? She holds up a Quran with holes drilled in it. Because, <laughs> their, because the, their ideology is, it has holes drilled in it, if you start picking it. Okay, let me tell you this. You know, you could laugh all you want. Um, the Tommy people, the Tommy supporters, the TR movements. You can laugh all you want. But let me tell you this. This Hatun, when I see her out of the park, and when I, I, I've seen her out of the park before, and when she goes out of the park, she doesn't act like this. But when she goes in the park, she acts different. There's two types of characters she does. And the thing is, Hatun... When I, when, I, when I see Hatun, I don't even go next to this lady. But the thing is, Tommy Robinson, he's another one. I don't like this guy. I don't like Hatun. I don't like Tommy Robinson. The reason why I don't like this guy, and many other Muslims doesn't even, well, they don't even like him as well, is because he's spreading hate. He lies about our prophet. He lies about Islam. So why do you think he would support Hatun, because they have the same mindset. They have the same agreement. Like, Hatun is very close friend with Tommy, and Tommy is very close friend with Hatun. Why do you think they will support each other? Because they agree in the same thing. Um, and she's violently attacked for it, especially with what's just happened over the cartoons. So I'm, I'm going to go this Sunday. I don't know what you're doing Sunday. Um, we'll be there. We were there a couple of weeks ago yeah. after the first time she was... Do you know what would uh, be a great moved. site? The best site ever for this Sunday would not be for groups of men turning up with masks on their face to show hostility. It would be for a sea of flowers and chocolates. So Hatton can be surrounded with absolute love by the British public to show that, you know what, we totally value what you are doing. We totally value the position you've put yourself in. You have put yourself in danger... And as I said, I've not seen anyone show courage like this. Um, and I'm concerned for her and worried for her. And I think the police need to also realise that these men who are continually violent to oppress free speech in Speaker's Corner, then they're the men that need to be removed from the park. Anyone showing violent hostility, they're the men, not, not removing the people who are expressing their free speech in a calm, disciplined manner. So, yeah, I'm going to be there this Sunday. So, and... Um, I'm going to recommend it. Go buy flowers, go buy chocolates, um, and go and let's surround that lady with a sea of love. Let her let her feel so loved. Let her know because I watched on a video and I wonder, and I wonder if the British public are aware of what's going on down there. I'm aware because I follow everything. <laughs> You see this free speech and this freedom, the liberalism, liberalism that they agree on. I don't agree with liberalism at all. You know, I don't agree with freedom. I don't agree with well, you can do what you want. Because let me tell you this, I don't agree with this. But I know there's liberal people that agree with liberal things, liberal society, freedom. That's why it's corruption in this world. You know why there's corruption? People follow their own... You know what, do you know what I think? I think people follow their own desires. That's why the world is such a corrupted place. Just sorry, just to finish off on the Hatun, and it's... Obviously, we've watched Hatun, we've had her on as a guest, uh, that she's been there following on from Jay Smith, who was there for decades. But it's quite impressive watching this little five foot something woman, and you've got these huge bearded Muslims. They were so intimidated by her. Yeah. They're intimidated by her free speech. But she They're holds her line every time. She does not back down ever. She just holds, because she knows she has truth on her side. She knows what she's saying actually is the truth and actually can unlock many people's lives. And, and when you look at her, I watch and know that. That lady is willing to die. And I know that. And there's not a question about it. Watch her videos. And if someone's willing to die to risk everything for your free speech, then the least you can do is support her when she's cornered aggressively 
And when she has made, she has, she has drawn the line in the sand that has been drawn for Speaker's Corner on Sunday. So this is where I'm going to stop. You know, you know, the thing is, you know, liberalism is affecting the society where people, people will do whatever they like to be free. To be free. I want to be gay. I want to be homosexual. I want to be like, you know, X, Y, Z. Like, people want to do these things. Why? So they want free. They want freedom. They want liberty. They want they want everything. You know what's do you know what's wrong with the society? What's wrong is this whole world is so corrupted with liberalism and this is the thing with liberalism is freedom. Tommy agrees with liberalism. He agrees with freedom so people can do whatever they like. They can be gay, they can be this, they can be X, Y, Z. This is liberalism. And I don't agree with liberalism. I really don't. I don't agree with it because thing is there's liberal Muslims. I don't agree with that because they want freedom. They want this. And the whole point what is corrupting the society is um, people are following their own desires, and that's what the that's why the whole society is corrupted. The world is corrupted. Why? Because people are following their own desires. Liberalism is the freedom of key. I want to do this. I want to have this. I want to have do this. I want to wake I want to wake up at night or morning and feel the sunshine coming up. And I want to do whatever I like and be gay and be war. You know, all of this is liberalism. That is affecting the society about freedom of speech. Uh, Tommy Robinson, he agreed with liberalism. And Hatun, there's supporters of Hatun like Tommy, apostate prophet, David Wood, all of these people, the TR movement as well, these are the far-right movement. They want, they all together, they accept liberalism, they want freedom of speech. And the thing is, this is what this is what happens to people where they're so like corrupted they want this to happen i want to do this i want to, it's all about me 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 everything me this is what liberalism does to you guys and it affects people and my opinion that people follow their own desires that's why the world is corrupted. And it's going to be more worse in this world. But like I said, like I was saying, people, that if Muslims do go to the park, do not act violence. Do not do anything like the other Muslim brother did, which is wrong. Do not do that same thing this Sunday. Because whoever goes, any Muslim, me or anyone, I don't know if I will go, but anyone, if you go to the park, please, please, please be smart and aware that do not put your hands on Hatun again or do not put your hands on Tommy Robinson, even though I hate him and Hatun. Do not put hands on, hands on them both. Don't. Be smart, yeah? If you can't control your angers, if you can control your emotions, then my advice is to you, Muslim, do not go. But if you can control it, then go, yeah? Not the low IQ Muslims, yeah? Because you are going to dis you're going, you're going to ruin it. So if you are able to control your emotions and all of this, you then go to the park. But if you can't, then my advice is to the Muslims, do not go to the park. But like I said, be smart, be careful, because if you do anything wrong, Tommy would be videoing it like he always does, 
to get his views up. And the whole world would see that and it would be bad. Like, it would look bad. Do you know what I mean? So don't let him win. Yeah? Let him say whatever he likes about Islam. Let Hatun say what she wants. Don't act violence. Don't put hands on both of them. Like what happened Sunday. Do not act any... If you see anything, you know, they laughing or anything or mocking, just walk away. That's the best thing. As Muslims, walk away, walk away. There's, It's not worth it. Walk away. If they say anything, violence to attack, you know, to do anything to you, just walk away, people. Walk away. It's not worth it. Don't hit, put your hands on me, both of them. Walk away because at the end of the day, if you do, they would win and you would lose. But Muslims, yeah, just be careful when you go to the park. And I might go, I don't know. But be careful, Muslim. Be careful.